there are a lot of variables to keep track of and manage as a small business owner. If you're in an e-commerce space, it can get even more complicated with things like online ordering and inventory management. But managing your e-commerce inventory has never been easier than it is right now. Online store owners have a myriad of tools at their disposal to make managing and syncing their inventory a breeze. In this video, we'll cover some of the ways you can tackle your inventory woes and get things under control with some best practices and tool suggestions. Let's double click on the term inventory management first, because it's important to talk about just how much this term encompasses. Inventory management refers to the process of ordering, storing, using, and selling inventory either online or in person. The processes outlined here include things like the production of goods, purchasing of raw materials, and reporting. Obviously, there's a wide range of topics to cover in this area, so this video will stick to the e-commerce side of things. Inventory management in e-commerce generally refers to making sure your inventory is correct between your online store and your system of record or brick and mortar, and some of the tricks you can use to get the most out of your catalog in both places. Managing your inventory is vital as a business owner, because you want to make sure you have enough in stock to fulfill your online orders in demand, and prevent overselling when possible. With the right amount of inventory and forecasting, you can double down on high selling products and tighten the reins on some of the more poor performing products when needed. All of these factors lead to a higher customer satisfaction in the long run, as customers will see you have what they need and won't be disappointed when they go to order a product that's actually out of stock. As I mentioned before, there are a lot of tools and techniques to make this side of the business as easy as possible. One of the first things you should look at is software that can manage or sync your inventory. There are a number of software applications and services that can help you manage your inventory and keep that stock on hand. Use NetSuite or QuickBooks as your system of record and connect it to your store via an integration to bridge the two. A good inventory management solution will allow you to list your products in multiple places with the click of a button. Take your inventory from QuickBooks and list it directly on Shopify, Amazon, or any other channels you have. These tools generally have demand forecasting and reporting built in, allowing you to see your standout products at a glance and prepare to stock up on the things that your business sells successfully. If an accounting solution is something you prefer to be included in this scenario, Webgility offers inventory syncing and transferring, as well as its main purpose being to pull your orders and expenses from your store to accounting. With a solution like Webgility, you might forego the in-depth customization and traditional inventory listing capabilities, but you'll be able to keep your stock levels in sync between stores and accounting, and keep a neat paper trail of it all along the way. Managing inventory, no matter how much process or software you have, can still take a bit of work getting set up. It's important to lay out some ground rules for new and existing inventory, so that you can follow a process and make the automation portion of everything run a little bit more smoothly. One key factor in managing inventory, especially for small businesses, is SKUs, or stock keeping units. SKUs act as a unique identifier for your products, and allow you to keep track of each product in its respective channel. By using a SKU that's unique for each of your items, you can keep your stock levels in sync and make sure your prices are consistent across platforms and also limit the number of mistakes made in data entry or recording. SKUs also enable software like Webgility to automatically sync your prices and inventory across platforms. When Webgility can see that an item shares a unique name or number between systems, it knows that every order that is processed and posted to accounting should affect the inventory for that particular SKU. Pair this with inventory forecasting in a stock workflow, and you can easily level up your catalog. All of these factors contribute to the top three priorities in inventory management sell whatever inventory you have for the maximum amount of profit, while keeping the lowest possible amount of inventory you can, and keeping your customers happy by having whatever they want in the stock. Check the link in the description for a full write-up on utilizing Webgility's sync and transfer features. And stick around and be sure to leave a comment with what you would like to see from the channel in the future.